Hello, this is H.C. Bailey, and welcome back to Let's Play Chrono Trigger. Today, I'm going to continue through 600 AD and find out what's going on here. Apparently, there's some soldiers who are battling mages. Yeah, of course I knew that. Okay, and there's a... Well, people think I'm crazy for talking about a millennial fair, apparently. And the army destroyed a Zenon bridge, so they can't get over here. Why would they destroy the bridge before they attack? I mean, they cut off their only route of attack. <laughs> I mean, that doesn't quite make sense to me. Ah, uh, whatever. You have to talk to those soldiers to let this guy in. His name is Toma, the explorer. Sure, I'll buy a drink for you. I think it takes like 10 gold or something to do that. Whatever. A negligible amount. Oh, the queen disappeared. Oh, they found her after all. Well, that's weird. Something fishy about the cathedral. Hmm. Well, maybe if it becomes important later on. But they found the queen, so it's all good. Let's check out the castle. I'm not going to show every battle. I'll probably just edit them out, so... Okay, I just wanted to handle that battle, and... Uh-oh. Okay, well, I can take care of these guys real quickly with a cyclone, so... Ow! It, it hurt! Kick the rock at me! You die! There we go. I'll only show the battles if I can get through them quickly enough. The, the enemies are all pretty vanilla here. And we get a power tab. Let's give that to Krana. You have selected Power Drive. Extra bonus points to anyone who knows what that's from. Okay, let's head up here. Uh-oh. Yeah, don't worry about using up your MP here. There's nothing to worry about. And Whoa! A yeah, monster ran away, but he dropped the shelter. And as you go through this forest over and over again, because you'll be going back and forth throughout the game quite a bit, check that spot out. Every time, you'll still get another shelter. So you'll never run out. Uh-oh. We're surrounded. It's a pincer attack. Is Final Fantasy VI the only one that calls that a pincer attack? I mean, I know they have those kind of battles in other Final Fantasy games, but I think that's the only one where they call it that. Okay, let's continue this way. Yeah, you like how I'm doing the transitions for the battles? Okay, let's see what's in this castle. More soldiers! No, I'm not one of Magus' troopers. Show us your stamp collection, son. What? What? I, I don't get it. They have stamps back then? I don't think they had stamps in 1000 AD. It's the queen, apparently. Kind of looks like Marley, but it can't be her. What, what, what's going on? Okay, well, we gotta follow the queen. Apparently she envies us for some reason. Maybe we look like her old boyfriend or something. I don't know. Okay, well, let's check out the Knight's Quarters first. I want to go exploring. And... Okay. Sir Cyrus. Uh, yeah, of course I've heard of him. I'm no airhead. And Yakra was in the western forest, but then there was a cathedral built, and he's not there anymore. Hmm. And Sir Cyrus is missing, and one of his friends, apparently, and... We must guard the bridge that is no longer there with our lives! And if we talk to her, we can rest up, so let's do that. Fortunately, unlike most other places in the game, they actually give us a separate bed for each of our party members. Unlike my house, for some reason, we all have to sleep in the same cramped bed. Now, one thing about this place is that, as you saw, there's a corresponding uh, Guardia Castle in 
uh, 1000 AD. So if you open up a chest here, and there's a corresponding chest in 1000 AD, the chest will be, will be empty in 1000 AD. And more to the point, it will contain a better item in the future. So you don't want to open most chests here because of that. Except for this one. That's the only one. There is no corresponding chest to the future with that chest. Oh, ice cream. Oh, I, I have a funny story about that. I remember one time I was talking to my brother about it, and I said ice cream, like I, I wanted to get something, uh, some ice cream, right? That, that's what he meant, right? I, or Queen Lean meant ice cream, right? And like 10 years after I played this game, I suddenly realized that ice cream was, you know, a mispronunciation or a misinterpretation by the chef as ice cream, you know, like the dessert, right? I always thought they said ice cream, ice cream, I mean, was like some French delicacy or, or something where they ate eyeballs or something. I don't know. I mean, this is back in 600 AD. Who knows what they ate back then? Okay, so now they want to feed the, the troops. And the chef is having trouble keeping up with the soldiers' bellies, apparently. Just feed my men. Yeah, well, the troops need to get fed because th they're kind of defending your life, you know, the walls around your castle. Okay. Let's go see the queen now. Enough dilly-dallying. Let's talk to the king. Yep, we saved your wife. Sure, yeah, I, I saved her. Who's the man? Who's the man? And she lost her coral pin. Hmm. And the chancellor is... Okay, he's walking away for some reason. He doesn't like me, apparently. I wonder why. Let's see. Yeah, don't open that chest. There's a corresponding chest in 1000 AD. The queen awaits you. And the queen is looking even younger than on her wedding day, apparently. Yeah. Well, I'm tougher than I look. And she wants to talk with this individual in private. Wink, wink, nudge, nudge. Ah, say no more, say no more. And you have to walk up closer to her. What? Oh, it's Marley, but they think she looks like the queen. For some reason, I don't know why. I knew you'd come for me. You're thinking with the wrong head there, Chrono. Why'd you go after her and risk your life for someone you barely knew? Regardless of, well, you, the fact that you didn't know her at all. She's being torn apart. What the hell? Save her! Save her, Chrono! Don't let her... Oh, no! She disappeared. Don't open that chest to the left there, either. That's not a good idea. Yep, I was polite. Well, yeah, I, I, we were just fooling around. <laughs> no, I didn't. Oh, I should have said yes. Oh, well. The knight is into the gossip of the castle? Okay. <laughs> okay, let's see what's going on. Ah, it's Luca! And she followed after us. Yeah, we found her, but she disappeared for no reason. I don't know why. And... Oh, she's... She's Princess Nadia? Why'd she call herself Marley? Oh, she's a descendant of Queen Lean. Okay, I get it. Oh, so that's how childbirth works. See, ladies, it's not so hard after all. All you have to do is go, <coughs> and boom, you got another kid right there. It's so easy. I guess they were trying to explain how lineage works from one family member to another down the line to a kid, you know? And if you kill off the ancestor, each subsequent one would thus die off. 
But since Marley, they found Marley instead of Lean, um, they called off their search. Lean was never found. Thus, Marley was never born in the future. So now we have to find the real queen. But that's all the time I have for this episode of Let's Play Chrono Trigger. Next time, I'll explore more of the castle and try to find out what happened to Nadia and where's Queen Lean. This is H.C. Bailey signing off. Have a good day.